I brought a little New England with me. Um, I brought a lot of New England with me besides my, my devotion to my Boston sports teams. I'm here with Pat at Lucy's Riverside Cafe, and she's moved here from Cape Cod or Boston, and being a Patriots fan isn't the only thing she's had to overcome here. Pat, tell us a little bit about your struggles that you've had. I originally moved to this area to be to find doctors um, to finally get diagnosed with MS. I don't use as a crutch, but I've had to adjust my life. And working and having the small place is is good for me because it, because it keeps me busy. I do a lot of bouncing off of my help or bouncing off the counters because that's what MS does. It, it takes your balance away. Um, and, and a lot of my customers know and, and honestly, I feel like you just have to be a warrior and work through it. I see that you have a really cool menu here and it's different than what you see everywhere else in town. Uh, tell us a little bit about what makes it so unique. Um, I adjusted my menu a lot to people with autoimmune diseases. My soups, my quiches, mm -hmm. um, everything starts from scratch. I do a lot of farm to table. There are a lot of people now that have diet, diet restrictions um, because of eating so much processed food over the years mm -hmm. that it's, it's starting to affect people. What's your favorite recipe? But if I had to say my favorite on this one would be the stuffed pancake only because of the people's reaction when it comes out. Because you get these two humongous pancakes with, it's layered with potato and egg and bacon or sausage. And and then you, you watch the, you know, whether it's a man or a woman and you watch it go to the table and they're like, you know, they're, they're just like, I can't get through that. But it's, it's like a challenge, I'm like, you know, I, I might not charge you for that if you eat it all, but they can never get through it. So one of the other amazing things that you don't see very often is that Pat makes these pies homemade from scratch. Is it every day? Well, when we need them. When you need them. Yeah, as yeah, you need. as needed. This particular one is, a, is, we call it a summer berry, and it's made with four different berries, of blueberries, raspberries, strawberries, and uh, blackberries. And, and it's just enough sweetness um, my husband and I love this pie, but all the customers do too. Mm -hmm. It's nice with uh, with some whipped cream. And by the way, I make my own homemade whipped cream. Wow! So people are like, they 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 like the pie because they know they're going to get the whipped, whipped cream, cream. right? Yeah. Right. <laughs> but we also do peach this time of year. We try to stay seasonal. Um, we know we're going to be getting into pumpkin season now pretty mm -hmm. soon, and everything will be pumpkin. So. Yeah. And who's this handsome fellow? This is my husband, Dan. Hi, Dan. He, nice. nice to meet this you. This is Michelle. Dan comes and picks me up every day, we, um, so I don't have to walk because of the MS. Walking some days is a, is a labor. Come check out Lucy's Riverside Cafe here in Freeport. This amazing community has this great little cafe you can come for breakfast or lunch. It's right across from Scott Scuba, and it has so much to offer. It's like home away from home. Come check it out.